What's going on, my guys? Welcome back to my channel. I am Garrett with Game by the Beach. Very excited to be here with you today because we are playing a brand spanking new deck that I just kind of came up with recently that I think might be pretty cool. I've been playing Scrapper a decent amount, and I've kind of realized that there's a number of different ways that you can play Scrapper. You can play Scrapper in the way with like Inquis and Knight Statue and like Bombardier, where you spam your board and then you eat all the monsters with your Scrapper, and that kind of works pretty cool. You could also kind of use it like Robot slash Summoner to where you copy all of your Scrappers and then combine Scrappers with Scrappers and with Mimes and with Harlequins in search for higher ranking stuff and it almost works better because if you combine if you merge let's say a rank two scrapper with a rank two mime a you're gonna get a rank three something and b you're gonna also get those uh leveled up tiers for another unit rather than if i have a rank two mime that gets eaten by a rank two scrapper you just you didn't get a merge rank upgrade but you are going to get an extra upgrade in a different way so Kind of an interesting concept, and let's see if we can kind of show it off. It's gonna be weird. All right, let's just do that. Let's do this. Oh, nope, wrong way. Boop, let's go that way. Let's go this way. Let's go, okay, okay, okay. We're gonna go here. Let's go there, let's go there. Uh, I'll go over here. Just need one more. Okay, we got to four. And now, if we want to eat some, we can. So we can go, like, here. Uh, okay. That's fine. Still fine. We got nine seconds. Gorgon. I wish I had another bo another one on my board, but we don't. But we're kind of just surviving. This is kind of funny. One, two, three. Here we go. Uh, I don't know. Let's just do that. All right. Because <laughs> then we can just eat them in a second. It's fine. But if you guys are enjoying this video, make sure that you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video, and also check out those memberships because if you guys haven't seen, we have a holiday exclusive special on poster boards. We've got brand new poster boards that we're selling. They are these three poster boards. Ch whichever one you want, guys, they're all awesome. I absolutely love these things. Check them out. If you want one, all you gotta be is a legendary member. Go to that join button, hit join, go to legendary. It's $25. But that's going to buy you a poster as well as shipping. So, I mean, depending on where you are around the country. But just let me know which one you want. I'm super excited to be able to give these to you guys because a lot of people have been asking for something along these lines. And finally, we have something that you can actually just purchase rather than like win off a raffle or something like that. So I'm really excited about those. Definitely check those out when you get a chance. But let's continue on. And uh, I'm just going to do that. Oh, see, now we're starting to do a little something. Oh, let's go that way. There she goes. There she goes. A little rank two right there. What else we got? Okay, we can go. Let's do this. Oh, yes. And now, and we can kind of do both methods. We can kind of... You know, merge our mimes with our with our um, scrapper, but we can also kind of eat the remaining stuff that we don't really want. So it works kind of both ways. But right now we've got a rank five on a square in quiz. We've got three rank threes, one rank two that's a copy, and then a bunch of rank ones. So we could eat all the rank ones. We could keep the way it is. We got bedlam next. I think we should be able to take this out really easily. There we go. And let's just, we got 900 mana. Let's hang out for right now. But I think I'm going to use this guy to just kind of get all these. Maybe go down to 7 because we've got 10, I believe. 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Um, maybe during Puppeteer. Maybe after Puppeteer. Maybe right before Puppeteer. Because then we'll be able to, you know, that will upgrade a bunch of our units. But then we can also spam back and get a bunch of stuff. So I think it'll be useful. Um, I'm going to just do... Well, I'm kind of scared, honestly. I'm, I'm kind of scared. I do have stasis in this deck for a little bit of slow, but we don't really have a whole lot of stases going on doing anything right now, so not really too useful. We've got one more gadget that we need to do before we are able to actually use its ability. 
but I'm really liking the idea of this deck. I think it's really good. You could probably go in the other direction instead of having Stasis. You could probably do Bombardier to make it as similar as possible, but you could also probably do like Knight Statue, and maybe you could even not even have Harlequin. I, I don't know. Maybe not. Without Harlequin, it might be tough, but you know, kind of an interesting concept. I have, this is the first game that I've played with this deck, so we're going to see if it actually works out, and if it does, that would be pretty cool. That is our last tile for Puppeteer, or for, uh, for Gadget, not Puppeteer. So it is going to move, it does not move us. Let's just do this, let's do that, let's do this. I'm going to do that. I'm going to do... Mm, let's get one more. Okay, let's do that. You guys are seeing how this works. Like, pretty cool right there. We've got a rank 5, a rank 4, two rank 4s, two rank 3s, a rank 2, and then a bunch of rank 1s. And now we have a couple of Stacys as well. And you can kind of see how I'm doing both methods with combining out you know, copying my scrappers and then com merging them with mimes or using my scrapper to eat a bunch of the stuff and then level them up. Using them both ways, I think, is really, really working. 18 seconds. Let's use our gadget now just to have a little bit of help taking all this stuff out. But I think we may have kind of discovered the best way to use scrapper. It's not really one or the other. It's finding a deck where you can use both. Get there! gonna wait tamer uh oh, tamer all right we're gonna wait but we got one mil to go through we got 6300 mana it's not too shady it's not too shady uh let's just combine these guys out i'm gonna do that i'm gonna do that keep going here we'll do this guy uh, i'm gonna combine out here as well do all these ones We got a rank five now. So he's got five mil to go through, but let's, let's, just, let's just look at our board. We got two rank fours, two rank threes, five rank twos, and a rank six Inquisitor with also, we could have had two rank four Stacys as well as, a, I think, two rank three Stacys. That's a leveled up board, man. That is a legitimately leveled up board. There's a win. I didn't hit, hit him with a good game. Good game, my friend. And right here, this is on the ladder, guys. We're up over 6,000 trophies. Yeah, his guards were a little underleveled. But we also got a little bit of a reward there. Win a battle with uh, Inquisitor. That's absolutely not why I wanted to play this game. It's, it's definitely not why, what, what was happening. Let's collect that. Let's check out what's happening over here. Friends, did he just add me as a friend? It's possible. I didn't look at what his name was. But let's try to jump into one more game and see if this is actually solid. Now this is the test. This is the test right here. Robot Bombardier, mm, you guys know it well. Let's see what we can do. I think first things first, let's just find an Inquisitor before I start copying. Because there's no point in copying and merging out Scrappers until you have a unit that you actually want to level up. So now we have an Inquis. Let's get him up one time. Let's make sure we can do this. And, okay, hit our gadget. I absolutely love making random decks, trying them out on the ladder, and finding some success. All right, you guys might say this is not, like, a totally new deck. I mean, it, you know, yeah, it's got Inquis, yeah, it's got Stasis. Yeah, Harlequin, yeah. But I feel like the way I'm playing it is different than most people would play it, and that makes me feel unique. And if you feel special, that's all that matter, guy, matters, guys. But put down in the comments what you guys are playing during this faction as well as what you hate playing against, all right? Because I'm playing this deck. What's the, what's my least favorite deck to play against right now? It's st it'd still probably be Shaman. But what's the most formidable? Probably Robot, right? All right. Well, let's see what we can do. Let's start spamming a little bit. All right. Now let's start copying some guys here. We'll go there. We'll go there. Spam again. Combine out. Combine out. Combine out. Hmm, a little rank three. Okay. What do we got? This guy? Can we get one more unit on our board? 
All right, let's just hang out with this board for now. But already we've got two rank twos. We've got seven units. It just seems like, it seems like I'm playing Summoner. It basically feels like I'm playing Summoner. Maybe there would be a way to get Summoner in this deck also and spam even more. It would be absolutely crazy. But it just feels really cool how we're actually playing it. However, with play, things that feel cool that you're playing, you like you think are cool, does that mean you're going to beat Robot? <laughs> Def definitely not always, but sometimes maybe, sometimes. So we got 700 mana. Let's just level up our guys a little bit here. Because I think we're going to be chilling for a little bit. And, uh, and yeah, maybe midway through this, this uh, wave, we can try and bust a few moves again. Let's check out where he's actually at. He's got a bunch of rank twos. He can combine out there. He's gonna, yeah, rank six or uh, merge six. Okay. Making our way on gadget. Got a thousand mana. We can still. We're making our way towards. I don't know. Two thousand twenty-five hundred would probably be good. Let's. Uh, I was just about to poke after I said that. So let's just patience, patience, young Padawans. Patience is key in life and in this game. All right, we're at we're at around there. All right, let's just do that. We'll do that. Uh, didn't really want to do that, but it's fine. Let's get our guy all the way up. Hmm. Notice that I I wanted to merge towards the square that's getting the buff. However, that meant using Scrapper to my mime, which destroys a unit rather than my mime to my scrapper which will met in turn would have gotten me a rank three and would have perhaps leveled up some of my units so it's important to know which way you're combining if you have a mime and a scrapper always combine the map mime to the scrapper not the scrapper to the mine to the mime we're learning as we go okay but how many rank ones do we have a good amount all right so we need to find a scrapper perhaps and then try to do a little some 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 Hit my gadget. 100 and... Oh, uh, it did switch us. All right, not a problem. Well, actually, this is super ugly. Uh, we don't have a single rank one scrapper. Uh, okay. What is this board? I don't know. Okay, so we want to go that way. We want to go this way. We want to go this way. We want to go that way. And this way. Uh, do we have any more rank 2 scrappers? Yes, we do. Let's go there. Let's go there. How many How many uh, inquisitors do we have? Four? We almost have a rank 5 something. Perhaps we can get that pretty soon. But we got Puppeteer next. We've got 2200 mana. Just go here. Go there. We're still leveling stuff up. I mean, we're still doing things. All right, that's the last gadget we need. We're still keeping things pretty forward in our portal. I mean, not it could be better. It could be worse. Puppeteer will probably level us down. It's going to definitely move us, but it's probably also going to level us down. There's one. Okay, let's go there. Let's go there. We're out of mana. Um, we'll just do that. We'll do that. Oh, <laughs> let's go. We got a max. <laughs> we got a max Inquisitor. I think we can use our our gadget now, which is good. We're trying to take things out pretty quickly. I mean, if it comes down to, like, Stasis first Bombardier, I think we have a decent shot. But, obviously, it's never going to be that simple. Let's hit our... Let's wait until the thing is gone. Let's hit our guy now, our gadget. Take that guy out. Come on. 
2100 mana. He's gonna be a couple mil. 100% he's gonna be a couple mil. One second. 2.6 for 600. So at least it'll hit him. That's good. Um, I'll just do that. Uh, I'll just do that. Oh. What do we got? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Come on, cuh. Uh, I'll just do that. Okay, okay, okay. I was trying to think out, think of the best way to go about that. It was, it was demolishing one of my, or eliminating one of my, uh, Inquisitors. That's, that's what I had to do. We still have a rank 6. 7. Still have a rank 7 Inquis. We've got two rank 3s, two rank 2s, and two rank 1s. And we also have a rank 4, 3, 2, and 1 stasis. So I feel like our board is way better than his, but he's got robot and I have inquisitor, so kind of unfortunate right there. Like look at this, guys. Look at our board versus his. I feel like ours is like could not be much better. And he's still in the driver's seat. Yeah, Stasis, do your thing, man. Come on. Gorgon's going to be tough. 20 seconds. He's taking things out so much faster than me. I'll just hit my guy now, Gadget. Don't you lose now, boy. All right, we took out a Vortex there. He's going to be a, he's going to have a hefty one also. 14. Alright, so we're both going to take a hit here. And it's going to come down to the next wave on whether or not... <laughs> Who's going to win? I don't even know because we're both going to take a hit. Neither of us have lost a heart yet. There's no point in me using my gadget. But it's basically Bombardier versus Stasis. And I should just try and spam out as many Stasis as I can. But I want to figure out the best time to use it because it might not just be right in the beginning like right now i don't think it'd be smart to combine everything out i want like the wave's gonna go for a little while before it's just completely slow if this was if we both make it through the next wave which i don't think we will but if we both do then i'm just gonna combine everything out to make as many stacys as possible that's that's what we need to do we still have one two three four five six stacys and seven um, <laughs> Inquisitors that are at a pretty high level, so let's just keep trying to hold on here. That's all we can do. His Bombardier's keeping him right at the front of the portal. Our Stacys are trying to do as much work as they can. 40 seconds already left. But at least, oh, that Fast Monster's cruising, but we're okay. We've got a bunch of Stacys. Under 30 seconds. <laughs> He's holding on to his gadget as long as he can. One million left. He's going to hit his gadget. No, he is not because he is accepting his fate. Hit him with the good game. Guys, did I just make a deck? Did I discover the key to playing Scrapper and actually using it effectively? Because a lot of people were saying, you know, if you're eating a monster, you're eliminating yourself mana or you're taking away a tier and then in turn leveling up somebody else, a tier isn't really worth it. Now you're getting the best of both worlds kind of worth it let me know in the comments what you guys think but that's going to be the end of this youtube video guys if you enjoyed make sure to like comment and subscribe check out those poster boards they're really really cool and i will check you guys out in tomorrow's video